<laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! What the f- Oh my lord. <laughs> I hate you so much! The time has come for Sailor Moon S. Jogai Ranto Shuyaku Sodatsen. Got the cartridge for $10 at a local used store. This game is from 1994. It is apparently the first fighting game made by Arc System Works, who you're very familiar with from Guilty Gear, Blaze Blue, Dragon Ball Fighters, Grand Blue Fantasy. This game came out 26 years ago, and it's a fighting game featuring characters from Sailor Moon and sprites from a side-scrolling beat-em-up game. So in fact, when they made this game, they only brushed up the sprites a little bit and changed their animations a little bit. But in general, these are their sprites that were used in a side-scrolling beat-em-up. I'm playing on a Super Nintendo Super Famicom controller. I really don't understand how this works because it doesn't have a joystick on it and Sanwa OBS F 30mm buttons, so... I don't know, maybe, maybe, do you hold it like, do you hold it like this? Do you hold it with one hand and then you, you tap the buttons with your finger? I, I don't know. I still don't really understand how to use it. And what character would you like me to play? Play Venus, Jupiter, Mars? You're all saying different people. Get it together, coffee beans. You need to act like a team. I don't understand what you're trying to say. I don't remember any of the names. Get out! In all, in all honesty, I can't remember the names of the three at the top. I know one of them is Uranus, one of them is Saturn, and one of them is... Vormir. It's Andrew! Melvin! Melvin! Remember the- remember the voice of the girl who's like friends with Melvin and Serena? Oh, Melvin! That was his name, right? Or was it Marvin? It's kind of strange because, honest- in all honesty, in- in the actual anime, you don't see them do a lot of hand-to-hand -hand combat. It's mostly girls throwing objects at people, but they don't actually get hit. There's a flash of light, some sparkles, and then people fizzle out into the ether. The truth is, it's not a very violent series. Which is really, which is really, which is why it's so strange that they went straight into the Sailor Moon fighting game and actually had them involved in, in physical violence, which is fine. But then it, it does remind me of the, the My Little Pony game. Sorry, the game that was meant to be a My Little Pony game, but then there was a cease and desist order and then it became a completely different game. But the main, the main concepts were really interesting because they were like ponies and they would fight with books because it avoids the whole violence aspect while still maintaining the important things about fighting games, you know? Going back and forth, pressing buttons, jumping up and down, playing rock, paper, scissors, really. So, like many fighting games, like Street Fighter, I think to do moves in this game, you can press your normal buttons. I've got punch, strong punch, light kick, strong kick. And if you roll your f fingers forward, you can do things like, uh, well, actually, this character doesn't. This character, well, she's got a roll forward button with kick. It does this. <laughs> For some reason in, in practice mode, it doesn't actually show you the life bar. So you, you don't actually get to find out how much damage you're doing. The Sailor Moon girls were like, this hand's rated E for everyone. But that's one of the important things about a lot of magical girl anime and a lot of things in Japan actually are very good at refocusing on elements that are not just the traditional violence. Maybe in other countries, okay, it's gonna be a fighting game, therefore there must be violence and there must be blood. And Japan, just because there's just so much anime and so much manga, there's a huge variety of things that involve fighting, you know, saving the world, but there doesn't actually have to be a lot of physical violence involved. And you know, friendship is magic. You can be absolutely certain that a concept like that comes from something like Sailor Moon. She can jump in the air and do a shoryuken with the punch. There we go. That's a fireball? No way, that's really difficult to do. That's a really strange movement to do because you gotta jump forward, then you gotta tap forward, then you've got to roll your finger for the, the Shoryuken version. <laughs> Plus I'm on pad. I believe this game was only released in Japan. Oh, dude! She literally launches a dragon at her enemy and electrifies them. So as much as I, I love the idea of this game, it is not very in keeping with the aesthetic of Sailor Moon, which is, you know, less focus on violence and more focus on friendship and helping each other out and, you know, waiting for Tuxedo Mask to, to come in and then do nothing and then leave. My job here is done. Oh, I've got a command grab. 
<laughs> I bet you could like loop this or something and there's just no way out of it or something. Was this actually made by Oxus? That's what I read on Wikipedia and I assume that it was true because how could we, how could Wikipedia be untrue? Ranma one half? Which came first? Ranma one half or this? Do you mean this game? This fighting game featuring characters from Ranma one half? Is this what you meant? 1992! All right, so this actually came out before. Is this the same company? You were ready with that box. Hey, who do you think I am? What is Ranma? What is Ranma? Look how epileptic fit inducing those, those arcade machines are in the background, by the way. How do I throw, by the way? Oh, I love this throw. <laughs> it's kind of difficult. Whoa, you literally lights Usagi on fire. Did you know that in Sailor Moon, Usagi is the only one with boots? I had no idea that Usagi is the only one with boots. And and Sailor Sailor Mars and the other Sailor suit characters, they've got like high heels on. Sailor Moon's the only one who's like not in heels. She's actually going through less trouble than the others. She doesn't understand the stress of being forced to wear high heels at work. Though I say that in the second episode when she gets the disguise pen, she puts on a pair of high heels for that, doesn't she? You really need to watch the original 90s in Japanese. What makes you think I haven't seen it? Coming in here accusing me of not having watched the originals in Japanese. Who do you think you are? Do you know who I am? How dare you? <laughs> I know you're teasing. I, I'm just joking. I did grow up with the dub, so the truth is I, I like the sub better. I like the sub better of this. I like the sub better of Dragon Ball. I like the sub better of every show that I used to watch as a kid. But the truth is it's hard to escape the fact that in your mind and in your heart, like the dub is kind of the original because it's the first one you saw. Oh, Melvin. Oh, Serena. Half circle motions on the SNES pad were like, Difficult. <laughs> WTF did I entered into? Welcome to the most important fighting game of all time. Yo, this is definitely not cool. There's nothing cool about this sweep. This is like already making me look feel kind of upset. Whoa, this is quite a nice background. Check this out. It's like Ken Ken Master's boat. So lore-wise, isn't Sailor Venus actually the original Sailor Moon? Sailor Venus is actually a hangover. She's actually, she's actually Sailor V, which is the comic that Takeuchi-san drew before she drew Sailor Moon. She is the living embodiment of a failed comic in Sailor Moon. How crazy is that? What's really hard about this pad, right, is not that it's just hard to press, but it takes forever for the, the button to actually come back up. Story mode or tournament mode? Story, story, story. Story it is. Ichiwagari! We're gonna fight and win and we're gonna show you who the ma real main character is. Oh, I pressed start. I, I think I may have skipped. Go! Whoa! Fireball, fireball! I'm guessing this is gonna work. Oh no! Low profile fireball! What are my other moves? Quick, 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 quick. What are my other moves? Do I have a DP? Oh, I can get out. I've got the get out of the corner button. Oh, help! Oh, I was trying to do super. This game's hard. What? Hey, what's up with these life bars? Why are they green and... Oh, what? Quick, tell me what the other moves are. I've got fireball, I've got a kick. Ouch! Oh, whoa, that that throw did so much damage. Hi, boku no na mi da wa. Oh, I didn't press start. Oh, God, I came over. I was, hey, I was busy reading, douchebag. I was reading that. Game over. <laughs> Let's try again. <laughs> I love that face. <laughs> Look at this face. Look at this. This is the face of a. This is the face of a hero. <laughs> These graphics are so good. Oh god, it's Mars again. Has she got like a life lead or something to start? Ouch! Okay, so the goal- the rule is don't- don't let go of block. Ow! Holy- holy- This game is insane! What the- 
This is ridiculous. <laughs> what happened? She like fell over. Ouch. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. What the f <laughs> The way she mashes that jab on my wake up. <laughs> oh my god, the recovery on the fireball is so bad. Oh my god. This is ridiculous. We're gonna do this. We have to get at least past the first battle. Hey, I remember that Chad in the background. What's his name? Jake or something. What's his name in the, in the dub? <laughs> is his name actually Chad, by the way? Oh my god, I was just joking. I just wanted to call him a Chad. I didn't know his name actually was Chad. Oh. She like does a cross up into throw and it's so annoying. Oh my god. What was that? What 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 just happened? What just happened? Did you see my life gauge? <gasps> Why does that crack shoot do so much damage on block? Oh! Yes! I got a round! <laughs> I got one round! Oh my one round! I'm so happy! I'm so happy. Oh man. Okay, hold on. I have a bad feeling that my my heavy fireball does no damage on block. My light my light one seems to be doing more damage. Yo, thank you for hosting the stream. How's your stream? Angry raccoon. Don't Where is my HP? Where did it go? Were you playing Sailor Moon? I hope you were playing Sailor Moon on your stream. Oh, the crack shoot! Bandai, right? Bandai's like, hey, we're teaming up with Toei to make a fighting game. Can you help us? Ark's like, did you say fighting game? <laughs> did you say fighting game? You want us to make you a fighting game? We'll make you wish you had never asked us that question. Can you make us a fighting game? Ark's like, <laughs> yeah, we can make you a fighting game. <laughs> you ever played Street Fighter 1? We're going to use that as our model. Oh no, I was busy. That does no damage. Oh lord, still getting hit by the fire. Oh, she's got the knees. Look at the knees! <laughs> Arxis, 25 years later, still using the same animations. Okay, it's not working with Sailor Venus. Let's try someone else. Okay, I got one command throw. It does like no damage. The heavy one does loads of damage. I need to do this like three more times. Yeah, Mono Sitara, this is a high score girl shirt, but I'm gonna be honest. It's like girls telling Haruo how much they love him and Haruo going, I don't understand. I like Street Fighter. I like Street Fighter. They're like, I literally love the crap out of you. Go out with me. And Haruo's like, Street Fighter. I only want to play Street Fighter. And everyone loves it just because it's got their favorite games in it. But the truth is the story is literally Street Fighter. I've got to play Street Fighter. I don't care what you think. I don't care what you feel. Play Street Fighter with me. Please, go out with me. Love me. Spend time with me. No. PC Engine forever. Neo Geo CD. And then yelling. My god, every time Haruo has nothing interesting to say, he just yells. What you're supposed to do when you only have one character um, and the main girl doesn't talk is you're supposed to have, like... A ferret. You're supposed to have like a, a ferret that the main character can talk to, or Luna, or Artemis, some sort of pet that he speaks to, but he doesn't. He doesn't have a pet. It's just Haruo talking to himself 
for like eight episodes. And then when a girl comes in that can actually, can actually speak, he doesn't talk to her because he's busy talking to... Oh no! I'm sorry I triggered that right. I'm just... Listen, I'm, I'm partially joking. I know that people enjoy it for whatever it is, and everyone has different reasons why they watch different anime. Oh. My. God. Did I win a battle? We did it! <laughs> Haduro! Ah! Oh. Yes! The wake up swing! Get out of here. What is she saying? Is she saying... Beripity dragon? I can't hear it. <laughs> it does sound like she's saying bibbity bobbity boo dragon. Bibbity bobbity doo dragon. Bibbity bobbity doo dragon. Yeah, come to me. Come to my foot. Come to my 5H. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> bibbity bobbity doo, I now control neutral. No, no, wait. What, what was it? What does he say in that meme? I can't remember. Bibbity bobbity dragon. Bibbidi bobbidi to dragon! Bibbidi bobbidi to dragon! Anti air kick! Bibbidi bobbidi to dragon! Anti air kick! Anti air kick! Oh no! Oh, you're. <laughs> <laughs> she took the time over literally at the last second. Is this how you win? What happened to GB versus? Um, we're temporarily considering cancelling it so that we can play this. Oh no! It's over, it's over, it's over, it's over, it's over. Fun's over. Anti air sweep. Anti air sweep. She's indestructible. Did you see block everything? <laughs> I hate you so much. But it's okay, because now you've gone down, and I am the victor. Oh my lord. <laughs> my thumbs. <sighs> my thumbs. Don't play fighting games on this. Uh, that was level two. Yeah, exactly. Honestly, I, I, I get it. It's like a lot of fighting games. It's not- you can't treat all fighting games. Although a lot of fighting games have shared aspects this game requires knowledge you know you need to know why that happens why this happens when you do this when can you press this and apparently apparently doing her getting her in the corner and throwing her on a wake up there wasn't a lot she could do about that in addition to playing on pad it's quite painful here are my concluding thoughts on this game. It's actually, it's actually quite a lot of fun. Otherwise, I wouldn't have played it for two and a half hours if I didn't think it was fun. It is fun, but it's frustrating not knowing when to, to press the right button and, and do stuff. But it, it was actually quite a lot of fun. And I guess I'm a grappler now. <laughs> it's unusual to play 
a fighting game these days where blocking really doesn't have that much reward. Like this game, even if you block, you take so much chip damage. It's almost like, why did I even bother blocking? What would you call these, those like eccentricities of the game? If you can get used to it, clearly there's a there's a fun there's clearly a quite quite a fun game here. I'm quite looking forward to trying out another fighting game for the Super Nintendo, one that came out two years earlier. Are you interested in seeing this? I picked this up at the same time. It costs I think a little bit extra. By the way, check out the price tag on this. This 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 game Ranma, when it released, it was nine thousand six hundred yen without tax. It was $110 in 1992. That must have been really cripplingly expensive to buy. I mean, three times cheaper than a Neo Geo AES cartridge, for sure. But still very expensive. I think the game was tons of fun. I would love to learn more about it, but if I ever play it again, I want to play it on stick. I think that's my, my takeaway. Like most fighting games, you can't treat them all the same. Even though they, they share aspects, they've got specificities, eccentricities that clearly require knowledge to to get into the ins and outs of the game. I would actually quite, I would love to play this game again. And I would I'd love to play against like a human player. I don't know if there's a way to get this online. Get my Super Nintendo online, please. Thanks everyone for joining us for this blast to the past with, or blast from the past rather, Sailor Moon S on Super Nintendo. Pret potentially, according to Wikipedia, the first fighting game that Ark ever made. But it might not be. Maybe this Ranma one-half game was the first one. Still don't really know. See you all in the next Nihongo Gamer stream and or video. Thanks for hanging out.